The Museum of Fine Arts in St. Petersburg is opening a fascinating new exhibition featuring the imaginative sculptures and videos of Shauna Moulton. Shauna joins me this morning along with museum curator Catherine Pill. Good morning, ladies. Good morning. morning. Shauna, I've got to say, the more I'm getting to know about Whispering Pines, so far a nine-part series, it's going to be a 10-part series come October. Mm -hmm. Whispering Pines, talk about the name and tell us a little bit about this exhibition. So Whispering Pines um, is, is quite a common um, name in the U.S. Um, and it happens to be the, the name of the mobile home park I grew up in, in central California between Fresno and Yosemite. Mm -hmm. But there's also, I heard a Whispering Pines um, in the Tampa area and different motels and roads are also named Whispering mm -hmm. Pines in mm -hmm. the US. Um, so I thought of it as a sort of um, archetype for um, the series I wanted to create. Um, and also a way to connect it to um, Twin Peaks, which was my first art experience as a kid. The, the series um, is about my alter ego, Cynthia, who is really just me with a wig. <laughs> and um, she, most of the, the videos are based on anecdotes from my life or my mom's life or my grandma's life. Um, so I decided to make it sort of geographically specific to where I grew up. Mm -hmm. Well, I was going to say, and Catherine, you're the one that's actually responsible for inviting Shauna here to join. What was it about Shauna's work that you were like, yes, this is what we need to get over in St. Pete? Um, it's fantastic because there's a humor to it that's really accessible and I think really universal, but also there's just this really earnest, you know, searching for self-improvement. So even though this may be a challenging exhibition for some of our audience, it's the first time we've had an entirely uh, video based exhibition in our big Hazel Huff wing. Um, I think there's just so many ways that people are going to engage with the adventures of Cynthia. And not just, I mean, we're seeing a, a look right now at one of your videos, but you do also sculptures as well that you kind of work into some of your videos. How exactly. as an artist are you able to weave those together? Well, it started with sculptures. Um, when I was a stu art student, I was making um, dresses with medical devices embedded in the fabric. That's an interesting combination. Yeah, and um, that's actually how um, Cynthia, the alter ego, um, originated. It was imagining what kind of person would need to wear a medical um, device based dress. So you're exploring a lot of a lot of different aspects of life and in fact one of the the lines that I saw that kind of kicked off the exhibition was you were talking about exploring the obsession with self-help fads and wellness therapies along with consumer culture. Again that seems like a lot of topics. How are you able to tie that together through your art? Well I mean those are obsessions that I have. You know mm -hmm. I'm obsessed with um, improving myself and I also love shopping and those two things are often combined for mm -hmm. me. So, um, you know, it's all very autobiographical. So it just sort of, the narratives sort of originate naturally from those personal um, obsessions or desires. And Catherine, I want to ask, what do you think people can come away with when they visit the museum and, and visit this exhibition? What do you think people will learn or discover or really enjoy? There's a lot to enjoy. Um, there's a lot of color. There's a lot of, nice. you know, sort of kitsch, but beautiful elements. Um, what I love about uh, the work is that it shows that you can make art out of so many different things. Mm -hmm. And I want people to come away with this sense of storytelling that Shauna is so fantastic at. Um, but also we want people to be uplifted. We're all in this together, this journey for self-improvement. Well, I'll say I, I was able to watch some of your videos and they definitely are uplifting. They make you think, but real quick, we are running out of time. I want to ask, what do you hope people come away with? Um, well, you know, not to take themselves too seriously. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, that's a good one. And she did it very quickly too. So <laughs> <laughs> thank you very, very much. Want to make sure and give some of the details too of the exhibit. There you go. Shauna Moulton, Journeys Out of the Body. It's going to be running now through October 9th. Once again, it's at the Museum of Fine Arts, which is on Beach Drive in St. Petersburg. Thank you so much, ladies. We appreciate thank it. You. Thank Best you. Best of luck. Thanks.